everyone welcome to my channel this is Chelsea if you're watching this video right now it's a sign that this reading is for you if this message resonates with you don't forget to hit like share and subscribe in this reading we are going to find out how does the person on your mind feel about you right now today is the 3rd of November 2023 time here in Kuala Lumpur Malaysia is 10 53 a.m. now let's get your reading started spirits and angels please show me for the person who's watching this video right now how does the person on your mind feel about them please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person emperor at the bottom of the deck so the person on your mind could be an aries could be a leo pisces cancer scorpio can be any sign okay fire energy aries sagittarius leo now eight of pentacles in my first four of cups in my first ace of pentacles hmm. the person on your mind right now if they don't see it right now or they don't feel it right now they're going to see it and they're going to feel it in the near future, okay? Somehow this reading turns into a little bit of a prediction, although we're asking how do they feel about you right now? Because the Ace of Pentacles is right here and Four of Cups in my first indicates a missed opportunity. So if this person doesn't feel it yet right now that you are a missed opportunity, they are going to feel that in the near future okay because the ace of pentacles indicates this person feeling like you are something solid you're someone solid you are valuable or will be valuable in their eyes in the future okay two of pentacles here is about first nine of swords now it makes me feel like this person may have been comparing you with something else or someone else and because it's two of pentacles is like weighing pros and cons making comparisons so it makes me feel like the person in your mind right now may be comparing you with somebody else currently and in the near future they're gonna see that you are the ace of pentacles you're worth it you're valuable you're more valuable than another option uh, or other options and not of sorts uh, the person in your mind has been thinking a lot about you or will be thinking a lot about you. Uh, Page of Cups, again, this person could be a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. I do see this person is starting to have some feelings for you, romantic feelings for you, if this is a romantic connection. If it's not, I do sense this person like liking you. Um, because... The Page of Pentacles, okay, Page is young, so maybe it's just the beginning part, uh, like, how do you say, they're beginning to like you or beginning to have romantic feelings for you, okay, uh, again, if this is a romantic connection, this is a, if this is not a romantic connection, they like you, they're beginning beginning to like you, but, you know, the uh, sun here is in my first, so it hasn't gone to that extent where oh i like you so much or i extremely like you and this is you know this this is the person that you know that i would like to offer everything give my my all to you it doesn't feel like that yet okay but potentially it could be and we've got the eight of pentacles in world first six of pentacles in wrist and the ten of wands in world first hmm. For some of you, see, again, I don't want to put, I don't want to invest everything, my all, into, into you, into this connection yet. It feels like it's going to take time. Because the Ten of Wands in reverse can indicate maybe this person doesn't want this to be like a one-sided kind of a connection. It feels like I want to make sure that it is an equal give and take. I want to make sure that, you know, it's fair for me. For us, one second, there's somebody who is calling me right now. <laughs> um, yeah, it's okay. It just ended. 
call just ended. Most likely, it's my my stuff that I've ordered online because I'm moving to a a, a new place. So I've been ordering a lot of stuff online. Anyway, so we've got these six of wands in reverse, the emperor. I would say like this person, because the emperor has gray beard. So I feel like this person may be feeling either that you are somebody very mature, more, or more mature than them, or you're somebody older than them, or this could actually be that person who is older and mature or wanting to be mature about the situation because again the emperor has been through a lot he's he's very mature so perhaps has had a lot of experiences in the past perhaps this person feels like through because of their past experiences they want to make sure that you are somebody they would like to you know eventually if you're somebody worth investing okay i would say or it could also go vice versa, where this person could be feeling like you're very mature and you may not want to invest fully in them and its connection um, so early on in the game. Okay, um, hmm. We've got the Knight of Pentacles right here and the King of Swords in the first. Um, the person in your mind right now could be a Virgo Capricorn Taurus. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, can be any sign. I do sense them feeling kind of lost because the hermit in reverse, searching for answers. Um, could also be quite stubborn because the of the Emperor and the Knight of Pentacles. So that means, because the Knight of Pentacles is a very slow energy, energy, even though they feel like they would like to, that you're valuable that, or that they would like to offer you some sort of a commitment here, but they're still kind of judging with the judgment here. So the person on your mind could still be judging the situation, trying to make judgment calls. And not and I don't see them I don't see them currently willing to, you know, put all eggs in one basket or invest fully in this in this connection as of right now. Because they wanna make sure again that, you know, the King of Swords and Lovers that it's they want to make sure that they're clear, that they know for sure, okay? They're still judging you. They're still, like, making judgment calls in regards to you, in regards to this connection. And I see them with the six of wands here in reverse feeling as though... Yeah, is it is it worth for me to go to war for you? That kind of energy to fight for you, to invest fully for you. They, they're not sure yet, okay? But they do think a lot about you and they don't mind, you know, like starting something because the page is, is um, like a new beginning as well. Page is young. Don't mind trying. Don't mind giving it a try. Don't mind starting something small, like baby steps, that kind of a an energy that I'm picking up on. Well, they do feel something for you or care about you or like you or it could be developing some feelings for you, romantic feelings for you if this is a romantic connection. But I feel like they are still not sure, yeah, because the sun is in my first lack of clarity. But eventually two of pentacles in my first feels like they're gonna I feel like they're comparing you and somebody else or something else. Again, been thinking a lot, right? Nine of Swords. But eventually you could be feeling like wanting to reach out to you or offer you some sort of commitment. But I, I'm also seeing another thing here for some of you, if this is someone you're separated from, okay? There's a Six of Cups here in our first. Kelly Kate, maybe this person could be feeling like... If you're separated from this person, there could be some bad memories in regards to the past that I feel could be making them not wanting to actually come forward or come forward that quickly or take actions towards you. Still kind of evaluating in regards to something that has happened between the two of you. Um, but I do see them feeling a little bit sorry here with Page of Cups. Page of Cups is, is a sorry, apologetic card sorry for you know causing some unhappiness or sorry for um not being able to either give or commit 
But also this could be a prediction where this person could be feeling sorry or apologizing to you eventually when they see you as a missed opportunity in result of after after a period of time of weighing pros and cons or comparing you with others, okay? That's what I'm seeing here anyway, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to all of my other channels. All of the links are in the description box below. For those of you who are Virgos, um, I have a Virgo-only channel. Link is in the description box below. And for those of you who are Sagittarius, I do have a Sagittarius-only channel. Link is also in the description box below. On this channel, I do go live very often. I give personal readings uh, during my live stream, but with Super Chat only. If you're interested, don't forget to hit on the bell, uh, on the bell notification button so you'll be notified every time when I go live and every time when I post your videos. Take care. I hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Love you. Bye.